Good evening. I said good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Thanks. Hello. <laughs> Thanks, Emma. Thank Thanks, welcome. So it is Thank Thursday. You. Excuse me? It's Thursday. But remember, oh, yeah. tomorrow we will have class. Okay, don't forget. Oh, yeah. Don't forget okay. to have class. Okay. You tell me which one. Well, I read on the chat that you had troubles with an audio, an audio exercise. Which one was the exercise? Or no, fue alguno de ustedes el que lo puso. Ah, fue Candy. And Stephanie is not here. Ah, Stephanie, which I'm one? Here, Mister. Which one was the the exercise that you have troubles with the audio? What? En el chat pusieron que habían tenido problemas con un audio. Yeah. Which one? What is the number of the exercise? It's in the mid, in the mid term. Creo que no se le oye, Stephanie. But it is in the midterm. No. Well, algún, alguien más le dio problema ese audio. No. Miss, a mí es el 4.8. Okay, let me let me check. Four point eight listening exercise. Yes, okay. correct. I'm going to report it. Lo voy a reportar. Okay. Okay. Yes, dice que uh -huh, no existe. It doesn't exist. Okay. Okay, I'm going to check the attendance. Welcome. And let's see. Okay, today is Thursday, 26th. Jocelyn Natalia. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Uh, Juana Candelaria, Karen Xiomara, present teacher, okay. Karina Yasmin, present teacher, okay. Carla Melissa, I'm here, ok. 
Okay. Catherine Stephanie. Present. Okay. Leslie Natalie. Present. Excellent. Lisbeth Martinez. Present teacher. Excellent. Lucia Elena. Lucia. Luz Virginia. Margarita Abigail. Present. Okay. María de los Ángeles. Present teacher. Okay. Martín Ernesto. No yet. Miley. Present. Okay. Melissa Guadalupe. No yet. Melissa Guadalupe. Michelle Beatriz. Michelle. No sé si es la compañera que dijo que estaba en una vela. Vi yo que el mensaje en WhatsApp decía el nombre de Michelle, pero no vi el, el, el apellido. No sé cuánta compañera Michelle tenemos. Today. Ahora mando eso. A ver. Hace un ah, momentito yes. lo mandó. Yes, 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 yes. Sí, cierto. Thank you. Raúl. Roberto Carlos. Present teacher. Roberto Eduardo. Uh, I'm here, present. Okay. Rodi Dalila. Y la vi. Rodi. No se le oye, pero ahí está. Sandra. Sandra Maritza. Martín, welcome. Hi, teacher. Hello. Casi le pongo an attendance. And Selma. I am here. Okay, Stephanie. Stephanie Abigail. No here. Um, Victoria. Presa. Okay. Recapitulando, Raúl. Melissa Guadalupe. Present teacher. And my little student. Present teacher. Huh? And my little student, what is it? What is he? Solo el goodbye me dice y no me dice el present. Um, Lucia? No? Okay. Did you complete the two exercises from yesterday? Ahí está viendo okay. que. Ah, okay. Welcome. Okay. 
Muy bien, ahí está viendo que tenemos problemas casi con lo mismo. O sea, la mayoría ha fallado en lo mismo. Con los uncountable nouns. Okay, entonces, eh, recuerde que para los, um, cuando son cosas que no podemos contar, okay, vamos a usar el verbo en qué forma. En singular. Yes, en singular. Como ahorita estamos, esta regla aplicaría para todos los tiempos. Ahorita lo estamos utilizando en simple present, ¿verdad? There is, simple present. Pero la misma regla les va a servir para los otros tiempos. Por ejemplo, si vamos a, a decir en pasado que había o que no había o qué cantidad había en el pasado. Entonces, igual, esa misma regla nos va a servir cuando estemos utilizando past. O sea, nuestro verbo, obviamente, el verbo to be, en lugar de estar en presente, va a estar en pasado. Pero es importante que lo recuerden porque, o sea, les va a servir para varias cosas. ¿verdad? No solamente ahorita, sino que recuerden que estamos construyendo la base para los otros tiempos que van a aprender. Entonces, es necesario que tengan eso claro. Y lo otro que vi, some of the, uh, some of the prepositions, right? Pero yo creo que es más por una palabra, creo que es la que les hizo falta, de next, next to the. Okay, next to the library. Creo que la mayoría en, en esa palabra fue la que le faltó. No era en sí que estaba mala la preposición, sino que les faltó esa palabra. Que solo habían dejado next to library. Es next to the library. Y, well, creo que, ah, y la de onion, ¿verdad? Creo que, que es en esa fallaron varios también que como inicia con vowel, como inicia, eh, bueno, primero tenía que ver si era singular o plural. Ok, onion, singular. Entonces iba a utilizar a o an. En este caso, como onion empieza con vowel, we have to use an, an, onion. Ok, entonces esas fueron quizás las en las que la mayoría, no la mayoría, algunos eh, se, se, se confundieron un poquito. Pero vaya, vamos a hacer este día, we are going to work on the plot questions eh, regarding to those exercises. No. Okay, I assume it's clear. So we are going to, to do the exercises from the platform. But in la plataforma está más fácil. It's easier because they only give you two options. Pero in general, no le van a dar only two options, okay? You have to analyze If it is countable, non-countable, singular, plural, and all of the factors that we uh, saw yesterday in class, okay? So let's do those exercises, and then we are going to make a review. Well, let's 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 do that. Um, it will be. Three point nine, three point nine. Okay. Todos lo completaron ya. Así les puedo preguntar con libertad. No tienen excusa. You don't have excuse. ¿Ya hicieron el three point nine? Raise your hand. Levante la mano. ¿Quién ya lo hizo? Three point nine. No, I don't. No, todavía no. 
Okay, what? Todavía no, teacher. Okay. I, I think I already did it. Okay, one, two, three. Only three. Okay. So let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, Melissa. Can... Muy bien. Tenemos, bueno, ayer estaban consultando acerca de pollution, eh, si era contable o non contable, right? Entonces, ahorita vamos a, vamos a ver acá. Ok, tenemos number one, a Roberto Eduardo. I'm freeze. Yes. Uh, Roberto Eduardo. Number one, can you read the complete sentence with the answer? Okay, hold on. Just give me a minute because my cell phone, I see the letters a little bit. Okay, I'm, need going, to make to, a I, I'm going to read it. Okay, ah, okay. The, the sentence says there is and then you have to to pick much or many noise uh, i think is there is much much noise there is much noise okay thank you number two selma selma number two There are many restaurants. Okay, there are many restaurants. Number three, Martin. There is much crime. Okay, there is much crime. Number four, Victoria. Many? Yes. Uh, many. Victoria, would you repeat your answer, many. please? Many. Read, the, read the complete sentence. Many tra traffic. There is. There is. Many traffic. Okay. Most. Ajá. I, bueno, ayer teníamos una discrepancia entre si era contable o no contable de traffic. Uh -huh. Pero nos da también una pista. ¿Cuál sería la pista acá? El singular, de is, para no Ajá. contable. El, ok, yes, that's correct. Because the verb is in, in singular, ok, we can assume that the the noun, uh, it's uncountable, okay? Porque, porque está utilizando el verbo en singular, okay? So yes, much. There is much traffic. Number five, mainly. There are many apartments buildings. Okay, there are many apartments buildings. Okay, that's the first part. Que está eh, easy because you only have to choose between much or many. Okay, number part two. Okay, give me a minute. Okay, now we are going to, to choose between a few and a little. Okay, a few and a little. And um, number one, it's for uh, Luz, Virginia. Number two, 
Luz Virginia. No se le escucha. You can type your answer. Puede escribir en el chat su respuesta. Muy bien. Recordemos con cuál íbamos a usar a few y con cuál íbamos a usar a little. Para contables. A few. Eh, contable, obviamente. A little. Yes? Agree? Or disagree? Disagree. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo sería entonces? A few with um, countable and uncountable a little. Ok, correct. A little uncountable and a few Contable. Ok. Eh, aquí lo que puede hacer para recordarse, por ejemplo, few, if, if, if you want to translate, it's like pocos. Ok. Pocos. So you can use it in, with things, you can count. And a little is like poquito de algo. Okay, algo que you cannot count, you cannot, you cannot measure. Okay, entonces aquí utiliza a little. Okay, I don't know if it is clear. Well, you, you have to try to remember. Okay, you have to try to remember. Okay, so here, let's check the answer. A little, okay. A little pollution. Okay, correct. Number two, Roberto Carlos. Yes, teacher. There are a few shopping centers. A few, okay. Mm -hmm. There are a few shopping centers. Okay. Number three, Margarita. There are a few schools in this neighborhood. Okay, yes. Countable, right? Number four, Karina. Seria. Eh, a little. Okay, correct. There is a little traffic. There is a little traffic. A dream, like a dream. Because it's not true. <laughs> Number five, Melissa. There, is, there are a few traffic lights in the city. Okay, yes, correct. A few traffic lights. Okay, in the next part, we have in negative form. Aquí lo que va a variar de singular or plural será qué parte. ¿Cómo vamos a identificarlo? Es una. Okay, correct, the verb to be. Okay, depending on the verb to be, we are going to say if it is singular or plural because the yeah. quantifier is the same. Okay, can the number one. There aren't any taxis in the part of town. Okay. In this part of town. And number two, Karen.
Karen, Xiomara. Hello, ¿me escucha? Yes. Ok. Andrea. Is not o oh, la contracción sería isn't isn't uh -huh. isn't eh, any traffic okay there isn't any traffic okay yes Sandra number three Quiero ver un transporte um, de, ar, de armas. De armas. En public transportation. Um, Which one? Super. Um, sería de, de, ar, de armas. En Ah, they are not. Okay. okay. Catherine, are you agree? Uh, is there, there isn't any public. Any public. Okay, why? ¿Por qué sería en singular and not plural? Usted me va a decir, pero lo, the buses, we can count the buses. Or we can count the, I don't know, the, the taxis. But here the meaning is transportation. Okay? It's like a, a concept. A, a, yes, you can count the buses, the taxis, but you cannot count the concept. So in this case, it has to be singular because it's uncountable. Es como un término que you cannot count because there is public transportation, okay? And also, you, uh, you cannot say, uh, for example, there are public transportations, okay? No se, no se utiliza de esa manera, okay? Así que, Yes, tendría que ser in singular. I don't know if it is clear. Es similar to lo que estábamos hablando ayer del traffic. Because public transportation is like a service. Yes, the buses offer a service. And it's saying that this service um, ends at, at 9 p.m. Yes or no? I'm confusing you. <laughs> Está claro? Why public transportation is singular? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, thanks. Number four. Yes. Questions? Claro como el chocolate. Yeah, something like that, teacher. Oh my God. It is not nah, nah, just, just kidding. Nah, just, nah, just kidding. <laughs> Casi me da un heart attack. Okay, number four. Leslie. Eh, creería que sería there aren't parking space. Spaces, uh -huh. yes, because it's in plural, yes. There aren't any. You eat the any. 
Yes, Lisbeth. The other question. Yes. There isn't any crime. Yes, correct. There isn't any crime. So cross your fingers. Yeah, they are correct. Okay, do you want to take a photo of the, the answers for the ones you did? <laughs> or do you want to do it by yourself? Or only to compare, not to copy. To compare when you finish <laughs> to work on the answers. Okay. Okay, now we're going to do the reading exercise. Okay, this one. The world in one neighborhood. You read and then check the things you can find in Astoria. There are six. Ah, too easy. Okay. Okay, can you see? Or it's better? It's better? It's big enough? Yes, no, maybe. Nunca había tenido un grupo tan callado. You are too quiet. Okay, let us start the reading. We are going to make the Sorry. Me estaba quejando de que nadie me respondía. Sorry. Okay. I have troubles with the internet. Maybe it's the weather, you know. That's why maybe you have trouble with your internet. Do they eat? Hot. Yesterday oh. was cold. Today is hot. That's rare. Yeah, yeah that's weird. Okay. Crazy. It, it's 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 big enough. Can you read it? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, we're going to start with. Jocelyn, you are going to read uh, number one, only, only the first paragraph until here, playing in a restaurant. Okay, Jocelyn? De leerlo hasta el punto. Yes, until, okay. until here. Okay. The cinder ones are crowded with Indian women and colorful tradition dress. A woman is woman on their core is saging Chinese cakes. I knew some from a Romania. Bang is playing in a restaurant. Okay. Questions about vocabulary words. Sidewalks. Do you know what is a sidewalk? Aceras. Yes. Okay. It's crowded for people to walk in. Okay, for people to walk in. The, Okay, this is the sidewalk. Okay, you have to walk in the sidewalk. You cannot walk on the street. Okay, 
What else? Crowded? What is crowded? Lleno. Yes, full of people. A lot of people. Okay, a lot of people. Okay, let's see. Corner. Esquina. Esquina. Okay, selling. Vendiendo. Okay. Okay. Now let's continue with uh, Roddy. It's until until city. Microphone, can you speak? It doesn't function. No se le escucha. Okay, so continue, Maria de los Angeles. Maria de los Angeles. Carla Melissa. Hasta donde? Until fast. Okay. Astoria uh, was uh, once, once a most great neighborhood, but the area is changing fast. Where are you? Here. It is started here. Is it India? Or no? Yes. It start here and finish here. Okay. Is it India? China, Romania. No, it's a story, a neighborhood in Queens, New York City. A story was once a mostly Greek neighborhood, but the area is changing fast. Okay, changing fast. Correct. Tell me, Auntie, well, let's finish the last part with Leslie. Leslie. De, del punto dos hacia abajo, que no alcanzo a ver bien. Pero... Yes. Donde inicia the, the new. India. Ah, ah, yes, new, correct. The new residence. Mm -hmm. Ahí. Yes. 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 La parte de abajo no se ve muy bien por el cosito del zoom. Pero ya, ya voy a ver. Bueno. The new residence bring many traditions. This tradition bring together to make a story a trolley. Multicultural when the people are surrounded, surrounded by different cultures, surrounded, surrounded. Está leyendo del número dos para abajo, dicho. Ajá. Okay, no, no, y vamos acá. New residents. Well, ah, Ajá. perdón, me confundí porque le, le echo suma a la pantalla porque no. Pero no ya avanzó, teacher. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay, only new residents from India, Pakistan, Thailand, China, and all over the United States are moving in. Muy bien, lo que les iba a preguntar. Thank you. Um, what quantifiers um, did you 
uh, read or did you read? Or can you observe here in the, only in the first part? Tell me the quantifiers. Zero. No se han utilizado quantifiers? No. Oh, let me see. No. Over. Which one? A new scene. Repeat. No. Zero. No. No quantifiers. Yo no la veo, teacher. Okay. Once a monthly is quantifier. No. Podría ser over. ¿Cuál? Once a monthly. Yes. Correct. Yes. Correct. Okay. Mostly. Okay, mostly. Uh -huh. mostly. Astoria one, uh, was. Once a mostly Greek neighborhood. O sea, mayormente, o en un principio era mayormente, que okay, mostly. Okay, that's a quantifier to say, uh, like, uh, over 80%, for example, of the population was Greek. Okay, so yes, that's correct. That's the uh, mm -hmm. crowded. Crowded. Uh, it's it's not a, a quantifier. ¿Qué le hace falta crowded para que pudiera considerarse un quantifier? O por qué no lo podríamos clasificar como quantifier? ¿Con qué, va a, ¿Con qué tiene que ir un quantifier? ¿Cuál sería la pareja inseparable? Con un noun. Recuerde que tiene que ir con un noun. Porque estamos hablando, o sea, refiriéndonos a ese noun. Estamos diciendo si hay mucho o hay poco de eso. Entonces, necesita ir acompañado de un now, ¿ok? Esa sería otra pista. Vamos ahora al number two, paragraph two. Eh, ¿Qué, Lisbeth? Ok. The new residents bring many traditions. The tradition blend together to make history a truly multicultural. Where people are surrounded by different cultures, they adopt the things that they like. Hasta donde dice? Hasta resident. Oye, papi, ¿quieres jugar fútbol con nosotros? Déjame las redes. Seis, one, resident. Okay, thank you. Okay, continue, Eduardo. Uh, okay, I got it. Uh, let me see. Uh, say one resident. Here in Astoria, that's correct, the, the Astoria. Mm -hmm. uh, it is in Sur Surprise. I don't know what it's Surprise. Then an Indian woman buy a Mexican tortilla from Korea grocery storage. This is one of the things that make the neighborhood special. Okay, yes, thank you. Okay, here, uh, quantifiers. Nada, 
No quantifiers. Multicultural. Different cultures. Many traditions. Hay many traditions. With many traditions. Well, many. Okay, yes. Many. Okay. What else? Multicultural is not a uh, um I it's not se me ha ido. ¿Qué estás viendo? Quantifier. Quantifier. Thank you. It's not a quantifier. Okay. Only that? Yes, only that. Okay, number three. Karen, until here, and then continue Melissa, until here, y termina Cande. Okay, start. Is in surprise that Absorian is becoming a very popular place to live. The rhythms are reasonable, reasonable, reasonable. reasonable. The neighbor is safe, it is very good. Public transport, transport, transportation. Okay. Melissa, there are expensive stores, many nice restaurants, and good place trip and vegetable mark. Okay, inexpensive, inexpensive stores. Okay, Cande, the last part. In Astoria is a comfortable place to live. Apartments are usually big and roomy. As one longtime resident says, why live anywhere else? Astoria has it all. Okay, thanks. Okay, do you see a quantifier? Many, Many nice restaurants. <laughs> Any restaurants? Any nice restaurants? Okay. Only that. What else? We have another one. Anywhere else? No. No. Mm -hmm. Long, long time. One long time. No. Very. Yes, correct. Very. Okay, it's not only good. It's very good, very good. Okay, very good public transportation. Okay, questions about vocabulary? No? Teacher. Yes? Repeat uh, pronunciation de real, son razonable. Reasonable. ¿Cómo? Reasonable. Reasonable. Thanks. Okay. How do you say uh, surprise? Surprising. 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 Okay. Surprising. Okay. What is it? Yes. Es verdad. Inexpensive. Okay. Comfortable. 
surrounded no questions okay no so let's do or oh, let's select uh things you can find in expensive stores big apartments good schools beautiful beaches great markets nice restaurants many different cultures restaurant. in okay, restaurants store. in expensive stores yes Okay. Big apartment. Uh, big apartment. Big apartment. Uh, uh, many different uh, cultures. Yeah. Yes. Good public transportation. Good public transportation. Great markets. Great markets. Okay. Great markets. Okay. Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, let's check. Yeah. Okay. So, questions so far? Solamente, todavía, we have a few minutes. Well, questions? No? Solo quería reforzarles una parte de eh, las prepositions. Okay. Las prepositions, si se fijan, eh, iban acompañadas de unas como eh, an article, okay, o una, o, or, um, como una palabra que complementa la, la preposición. Okay, entonces, les tenía por acá cuándo las íbamos a usar. Ahorita se los, se los comparto. Ok, tenemos... Uh, in, on, and at. Okay, when we are going to use uh, one one of these. Okay, for example, we, we can start with at. Okay, we are uh, when we talking about something very specific. Okay, very specific. Okay. You have to use at, for example, hours, okay, hours, addresses, or specific locations, okay. Entonces tenemos aquí some examples. Para eso vamos a utilizar at, okay, when it's something very specific. Then we are going to use on, to more specific, but not very specific, okay? For example, days, uh, weekend, streets, avenues, okay, on. Entonces, se recuerda que, eh, por ejemplo, there is a library on Oxford Street. Okay, or um, uh, for example, give me give me another example. Give me another sentence using on in um, a preposition. Is on the box. Okay, the book is on the box. Okay, correct. Muy bien, and in will be for general, okay, something bigger in general, ok, 
Okay, we have centuries, decades, decades, years, months, weeks, a country, a city, or a neighborhood. Okay, for example, uh, I live in San Salvador, or I live in Soyapango. Okay, or uh, there are many shoe stores in Soyapango. Okay, or um, there isn't any pupuseria in England. Yes. Okay, esto para que pueda utilizar correctamente. Okay, in, on, or at. Okay, eso era como algo que les quería reforzar. Questions? You're going to send a link, uh, teacher, about this this picture or something like that the, photo the, the, photo, the, 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 the photo the screenshot the photo the screenshot okay yeah. okay i will send okay it. okay thank you okay only let me check if you are here uh lucia no uh michelle creo que al final se logró conectar Yes, present teacher. Okay, okay. Raúl? Sandra? Presente teacher. Stephanie Abigail? Stephanie? No? No. Okay, questions, something, oh, okay, tiene algo, eh, algún tema que cree que necesitamos reforzar el día de mañana? Tomorrow we are going to make a review. So if you have doubts in something, tell me in order to prepare material for you. Extra material, more exercises, more work. No? <laughs> yes, for exercise. Which one? Yes, but in learning more. But, but related to what? What do you think you need to reinforce? ¿Qué creen? Un, un comfortable and uncomfortable. Comfortable and uncomfortable. Okay. Quantifier. Quantifiers. Yes, but uh, about what? The topic, tell me the topics. Only, only those. Simple past, empezamos viendo simple past. Eso está clarísimo. Yes, yeah, simple past is yes. For me, it's yes. Bye. Okay. Okay, Martin. Ah. <laughs> okay, simple pass two. Okay. Muy bien. So, uh, we, are, um, we are going to make a short review tomorrow and um, I will send you uh, one exercise and we are going to discuss the exercise in class. Or maybe we can do a, a little competition here. Did you use Kahoot? ¿Ya han utilizado Kahoot? No. Okay. Tomorrow we are going to try. We are going to try something with Kahoot. No okay. teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's it. Thank you for being here. Get rest and see you tomorrow. Don't forget, tomorrow we have class. Okay. Oh, have a good night. Okay. Bye. Bye.
Thank you. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good Ya le puse en asistencia a María de los Ángeles. Don't worry. Okay, see you tomorrow.